Hello and welcome to Mr. PM's Footy Shirts and today I'm going to review the 2021-2022 Bayern Munich shirt I think it's the third one as well Right, let's go for a closer look There's your collar There's your... It's a bit bent There already, tags um, It says 2XL, probably it's more like an XL in these variants of shirts. Right, let's go for a look around the shirt then. Down this side, really good. Over there, really good. Couple of loose threads there. No major. Good hemline. Let's go to this side. So that sleeve to there. Right, let's have a look at the badges. Um, this is the oh, uh, that, this is supposed to be the fans version, but that badge is like a plastic. It's a bit sticky though. But it's, I like that. Maybe it's a little bit small. Personally, I think it should be a little bit bigger. But I like that. There's your Adidas, which is embroidered. I like that. Thanks for that. I think so. That badge has been. Um, stuck on and here's your T-Mobile oh that's a really good sponsor that's really good I like that one and there's your Aero Reading which is heat pressed on and here's the sleeve sponsor Qatar Airways and that's just as good as the T-Mobile really good really good that right let's turn it around and have a look at the back of the shirt Right, here we are at the back of the shirt. Let's go for a closer look. There's the collar. Really good collar line on this one. Really is good at the moment. Good. To the bottom of the shirt. M line. Really good. Really good. This is a really good uh, replica of the shirt at the moment. To there, under that silly. Really good. Really, really good. Really good. Right, um, this one has the FC Bayern Motion, well Munich, but I say Motion. Um, it is looks it's heat pressed on, and that's really good as well. And it's also got a little badge on there, which is really nice, which is heat pressed on. Yeah, I like this one at the moment. It's really good. Right, let's turn it inside out. And have a look what it's like on the inside. All right, here we are on the inside of the shirt. Let's go for a close look on the inside. This one, yeah, it's a bit uneven on this part here, a little bit, but it's on the inside, isn't it? So you don't see it. There's your little 20 21 label with your little barcode and Adidas, which is normally you get on these Adidas shirts. Yeah. Looks like pencil. Oh, God, that doesn't look. Look, it's on the inside of the shed. Hopefully, it washes off. That's not good, is it? Pen or pencil? Oh, oh well, I was having. Uh, I was really raving this one, and then that just spoiled it a little bit. All right, let's go to the sleeves. A few loose threads there. Not bad. Good hemline. There's your mandatory washing instructions. So this sleeve, good. To there, good. To there, good. Good. All right, let's have a look at the badges. That's heat pressed on, so obviously you can see it. And um, Adidas. Just a few little threads and a bit of paper, and then a big pen mark over the top of it. Eesh. Um, obviously, this one's heat pressed on, and it's really good. You can't even feel it. Can't even feel it. Right, let's have a look what it's like on the back of the inside of the shirt. This is just a quick little look on the back of the shirt because there's not much to really to look at. Good, good stitching on there. Let's go to this part. Good. 
Really good stitching. Really good stitching. Good. 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 There's your L already made in Thailand. Like I said, it's probably more like a NXL in these shirts. Right, let's turn it inside out again and I'll do my final thoughts and wrap up the video. Right, here we are back at the front of the shirt. Let's do my final thoughts. Right, material. Yeah, it's a standard air already Adidas material, which is really nice and nice and breathable. Right, things that I found with the shirt. Um, I was really impressed with this one overall until I found that this that pen mark on that side. I mean, look, it's on the inside, um, and it might wash off, but that's not very good, is it? <laughs> not good at all. Um, and the other thing I had with the shirt is it took so long to come to me. This uh, when I ordered this, this season was still going in Germany, and obviously I've just received it, and it's like nearly a month since the season finished, so it's not very not a very quick delivery time. And I had to message the seller constantly to find out where my shirt was, so not good on that one. Right, things that I do like about this shirt. Um, well, for one, it's just. I like the gold, the gold on the shirt, it looks really good gold, gold and black, delicious gold and black, and obviously you can see you've got your gold and black there, gold, it just looks, gold and black looks cool on shirts, and I like this pattern design as well, the way it goes up and down, it just the, the, the uh, white speckles down it, so I like that and that, I like about it, um, just a shame it took like nearly two months to get to me, and then to find he's got is a pen line in this in inside the shirt. That's not very good. So like I said, I do honest reviews on these shirts and it's my honest opinion it's that's poor finding lines and stuff on shirts, so I don't think I'll be going to that seller again on eBay. I'll put uh, I'll I'll actually put his D his link in my description. If you wanna go to him, go to him. Personally I wouldn't. <laughs> and, <laughs> so if you've liked my video Give me a like, give me a subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Bye now.